Hey there, and welcome to ComChat number five. It is now what? We're halfway through and steaming towards the end of the semester. Oh my God, yes, yes. Towards the end of October, here we are. Oh, Halloween yeah. is next week, my goodness. I hope everyone's getting ready. But joining yeah. us today is Dana C., mm -hmm. distinguished faculty of our common department. And yes. Dana, thanks for joining us. I know getting you to come down here on camera was, I'm glad you could join yes. us. Really, I am. <laughs> because <laughs> you are. <laughs> but uh, you're here. Only uh, for you all. Well, okay. thank you. Mm -hmm. and, and you've brought swag. Tell yeah, us about yeah, what yeah. you have and the student organizations they represent. Well, I, I'm, I'm excited about sharing with you all the um, exciting activities and organizations that I happen to be fortunate to be faculty advisor of. Uh, the first is NABJ. Let's hold it up, Sharon. Oh, yeah. sure, of course. Here we are. Mm -hmm. So NABJ. NABJ mm -hmm. is the um, student organization chap or student chapter of the National Association of Black Journalists, which is a national chapter of uh, black journalists uh, all mm -hmm. over the country and um, we've been in existence for about six years and uh, I've been advisor for the last three years mm -hmm. and um, the organization's mission is uh, the student chapter mission is to educate students on the different careers in journalism as well as giving them pertinent information about blacks in journalism mm -hmm. in front of and behind the camera um, and just bringing, being a voice to the students on campus about what's going on, not just in the black community, but what's going on with black journalists in this, this, um, in this area of journalism. Mm -hmm. And they're quite an active group. Mm -hmm. Oh, yes. Real active yes. the past three years. Yes, yes. Actually, we have um, an event coming up this evening. Oh, wow. Fact. And yeah. who is joining you this <laughs> evening? <laughs> this evening, our own. Uh, Ralph Merkel, oh, yes, yeah. is going to be on our panel, and uh, one of our other uh, newer faculty members, Karen Freeberg, she's going to be on the panel, and then Angie Fenton, who Angie is uh, with the, the Voice, Voice of Tribune, Tribune. Mm -hmm. and Correct. on TV Correct. on Channel 11, Correct. and I think an awesome person she really is. to, she to really inspire and she's, students. Mm -hmm. And she's very excited and very willing to come and share, and so we're very excited about our panel on this evening, and uh, we'll be talking about social media, the do's and don'ts, so it should be really interesting. Really and well, one of the do's is we have a social media kind of thing going on here where we send mm -hmm. the comm chat out to mm -hmm. students and mm -hmm. alums and yes. we just want, you cannot give people too much information, am I right? Well, <laughs> I wouldn't go that far <laughs> um, because actually that's one of the, the topics that mm -hmm. we'll be discussing because a lot of young people today put so much out on the social media trail on YouTube, on their Facebook page. Um, and one of the things that the panel will hopefully discuss is, you know, sometimes some too much can be too much. Less is more, oftentimes. Yeah. And Pull so it back a little. Exactly, <laughs> exactly, exactly. So that's what we'll be we'll be covering. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And that is, tell everybody where that's held. That's going to be right. in the Extram Library, mm -hmm. in W103, mm -hmm. uh, in the, the library, right in the newer part of the library. Nice setting. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. So make sure you come because that'll be, it's a nice setting, lots of room for everybody. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That's some great information and uh, I know because I've worked with some of your other workshops, you do not have mm -hmm. to be a black journalist to be part of your group. Absolutely not, <laughs> or, absolutely yes, not. And that's yeah. one of the things that I really stress with students because the, the idea here about this organization, even on the national level, is advocacy and mm -hmm. it's uh, being a voice. And so mm -hmm. one of the things, and that doesn't take just black persons to be a mm -hmm. voice you know about issues pertaining to black people so uh, one of the things that we are very um, uh, interested in is having a diverse group of students that are involved um, because we have them involved in graphic design and event planning and public relations and so there are a number of ways in which students can get some some experience mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Where and the red t another <laughs> t-shirt t-shirt yeah, anybody oh, that knows anything about me knows that i like clothes yeah. and yeah. shoes and all that so uh so yes so this is um this represents you though. yes exactly so this is lambda pi eta lambda which pi is eta. our honors organization in the, the department of communication okay. and um they are doing some really exciting things this year they actually have a raffle that will be starting on tuesday and they'll be selling tickets, $2 for students, $5 for the general public. And um, they are raising funds for the organization, but also to, um, to do some things for other students. 
mm -hmm. uh, in the coming semesters as well as to um, sponsor some kind of um, special speaker or whatnot each semester. So yeah. So they're doing some And things. in terms mm -hmm. of uh, hey, do I want to impress people with my diploma and what I've done in extracurricular absolutely, activities? This absolutely. This one is a bell ringer. Absolutely. Right. Actually, both right. of them are right. because yes. they're both right. academic organizations. Right. They're not mm -hmm. social organizations. Right. And, um, and so we very much stress academics and making sure that um, everyone is active uh, on campus in terms of, again, of being a voice. But the Lambda um, Pi Eta organization, they, um, they don't meet as regularly as the mm -hmm. uh, NABJ organization does, but they do still get together. For example, in the raffle, something that I need to mention, um, a couple of the giveaways are basketballs, footballs of the coaches, signed by Ooh. the coaches oh. and players, nice. and, um, and then gift basket with some goodies in it. And so there's, there's a lot going on that the students are very excited about. So, and our, our numbers, for both organizations have really, really grown, and mm -hmm. so we're very, very excited. And Lambda Pi Eta is an honorary thing. You, it is. You are asked to be in because you're so awesome, and well, it's a great Well, actually, uh, well, you're asked <laughs> to be in because you have the GPA. You the GPA. Yes, yeah, yeah. And, well, and you're awesome because awesome. yeah. you right, have the GPA. Right, and you're awesome, yes, <laughs> exactly. Um, it's actually for juniors and seniors, mm -hmm. and, um, and it's for juniors and seniors who have a 3.2 a 5 uh, GPA in their major and mm -hmm. a 3.0 GPA overall. Okay. So, yeah. So That's every comm student I every know. Every one of them. Oh, yes. Every one of them. So, come on. Yeah, if really. If you're a junior, senior, put your name down. Mm -hmm. See me in my office. That's right. <laughs> now you know who yes. the advisor is. Right. You buy those raffle right. tickets. Too. Right. Exactly. Exactly. We'll be down in the lobby of Strickler on the 18th um, selling uh, tickets on Great. the 18th in the afternoon. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, so Dana, see, see how quickly and easy this was to do. I don't know how easy it was. <laughs> oh, it was a sin. Quick, sense. yes. yes. So, but that, thank you so much. Oh, for sure. Having, We're glad you could join yes, us. So remember, yeah. NABJ on the twenty fourth uh, with Angie Fenton and mm -hmm. Karen Freeberg and myself, mm -hmm. and uh, Lambda Pi Eta, and both of those are things you should look at. Yes. But yes. that's it for ComChat Five. Mm -hmm. Student produced, by the way. Thank you yes. very much. Uh, we've got Philip Pennington. We've got DJ upstairs. We've got Austin upstairs. We've got Kurt Markwell upstairs. We appreciate their help. We'll see you next time.